the fellow travelers and foodie eaters. Mark here with Walter's World and today we're in San Diego, California, one of the coolest foodie places to come in California and in the U.S. This place is stock full of great craft beer, craft burgers, mom and pop restaurants, family restaurants, things you can really enjoy when you do come here. And so we're going to talk about today are the five things that you as a traveler need to have when you come here to San Diego. Because look, you don't have time to eat 500 things that you need to eat in San Diego before you die. You just need to eat these five things that I suggest, okay? Because they'll give you the biggest bang for your belly, belly. <laughs> anyway, the first thing you have to have is you need to have carne asada fries. Basically what carne asada fries are, it's a calorie bomb of happiness, okay? It's french fries, then on top of the french fries is carne asada, so like steak tips. And then they put guacamole and sour cream and cheese on top. Oh man, it is unbelievable. Man, it can be a big portion. So make sure you can kind of share with your friends, because I know I tried to finish mine and I couldn't. And you know me, I love my food, but oh, it is so good. And the thing is, that's really a San Diego thing, so make sure you are having it. And there's a couple places, if you look online, they'll tell you to go to Lolita's for that. But I went to Aldo Bartos uh, with, my, with my buddies, and we had a great time there because the food was just uh, amazing. And if you don't want that, you can have something else. If you say, oh, well, that looks like it's a little messy, Mark. Well, the second thing you need to have is a California special, and that is a California burrito, which is basically the carne asada fries wrapped in a tortilla. Okay, so that is the California burrito really is. It's, it's a, uh, you know, it's carne asada, guacamole, sour cream, cheese, and french fries put together in a, in a flour tortilla. And it is awesome, okay? So make sure you have that. And you get that lots of places in, in California, but just know it, it is one of those things you need to have. And the thing is, the Mexican food here in San Diego is great. And so no matter what you're having, you're going to enjoy it, whether it's the, the Baja tacos or stuff like that, like the fish tacos are really great, or any other kinds like pork belly tacos. Because the thing is, you have a lot of craft beer, craft uh, food makers, mom and pop places that let you try all kinds of different stuff. So you don't have to go to In-N-Out Burger every day kind of stuff. You can really have an amazing food experience here in San Diego. Now the third thing you need to eat when you come here is, I mean, we're on the coast, I gotta talk about the seafood. Look, seafood here in San Diego is great, and yes, you should have the fish tacos when you are here, but there's all kinds of fish from out in the, out in the ocean you can have, and there's plenty of restaurants that'll have it. So if you're going around, you might think that, oh, well, I'll have fish, I'll have crab, I'll have something like that, you'll be fine, but I always say is the fish tacos are always a winner when you are here. And the thing is, you'll have a lot of dishes that'll mix meat and fish, you know, surf and turfs kind of stuff. I mean, I had a surf and turf burger last night, or two nights ago actually. It was this amazing burger with lobster on top. It was like a lobster bomb on top of a bomb burger. Oh, it was awesome. And that's why I'm saying it's like the seafood here is really great. So don't be upset if you end up just eating seafood when you're here and you miss out on some of the other stuff, though you shouldn't, but it is really good. And the thing is, I mentioned that burger, and the next thing I wanna talk about you need to have when you are here, the fourth thing is have a craft burger. Have burgers from some of these mom and pop places or, or like entrepreneurs starting up their own burger joints because they have all kinds of crazy ones. You go to Slater's 50-50, you could have the 50-50 which is made of 50% ground beef, 50% bacon, oh my God, it, it's to die for. Or you get the PB&J one which is like, it's peanut butter and jelly on a burger with ice cream on top which is also awesome. But the thing is, I have a surf and turf ones and all throughout town, you have all these great burger joints and yes, you have great Mexican joints, you have great fusion all over the, all over the city. There's so many great restaurants here but the craft burgers, I think, would represent like the craftiness of the local food culture here. So do have a great time. But honestly, the best crafty stuff here is the fifth thing you have to have something to drink, and that's the craft beer. Look, you do not ever drink non-San Diego beers in San Diego. There's over 200 breweries and tasty rooms when you are here. If you go to North Park, they have a bunch there. You go to Miramar, there's all kinds of stuff. My buddy Daniel, he, I, I met him when I was here, and he's like, hey, I gotta show you these places. Took me to O'Brien's, and we had all kinds of beers and stuff like that, local stuff. And there's so many options that you can do a tour to go check some of these out, because sometimes they'll cluster together in different parts of the town, and so you kind of do a tour there. Now, make sure if you do that, use Lyft or Uber to get around, because you don't want to drink and drive, of course. But the thing is, those craft beers are really good, and it doesn't matter if it's a style, if it's an IPA, if it's a blonde, whatever. There's so many different kinds of beers they make here, craft beers, that it is really a beer, like a beer person's like paradise. Because yes, you've got the, the beach, which you can't drink your alcohol on, but that's another story. 
And the thing is, with the beer here, it's so popular. There's like paparazzi, <laughs> there's, there's bloggers that just follow the San Diego beer scene. Heck, the brewers here support lupus, you know, the lupus foundation. They do all kinds of stuff here because brewery and the, the craft beer industry is huge. And the thing is though, I know I've given you five things you have to eat and, and drink when you are here, but the thing is, I know it's California, and you think, well, Mark, we have to eat something healthy. I mean, where's the granola? I mean, it's California, man. All the stuff you talked about would make me look like you, and not everybody in San Diego looks like you, Mark, in terms of your size. Look, there is a lot of healthy stuff you can have here, like the, the seafood, but what I'd say is breakfast is a great time to eat healthy here. Um, you have what's called an acai bowl, so it's, you know, acai frozen paste kind of stuff with sliced up strawberries, bananas, coconut, um, and granola underneath with some honey on top. Honestly, I got that to take pictures of it, and then I got an Eggs Benedict, California style, and I'm like, just in case. And I actually love the acai bowl. It's actually really good, very healthy. And the thing is, is when you come here, you're gonna eat well no matter what time of day it is, because you know, if you want the carne asada fries, 24 hours a day, no problem. But if you're a brunch person, San Diego loves their brunch. And so all over town, you have places that are open for breakfast and lunch, or breakfast, lunch, and brunch. And you can eat some great stuff. I've had some amazing, I had a sope, that was a sope benedict. I have the, the, the Golden State Benedict. I have all these great foods that are here because it's really a cool, you know, brunch scene here and so you can go to different parts of town to have that you don't just have to eat in the gas lamp district go out and explore and enjoy the food all over the city because whether it is eating the fancy brunches having the acai and being you know healthy or or trying out one of those crazy burgers or eating the fantastic carne asada fries you will love eating here in san diego it is a great place with great people i mean these are actually super nice people here i've really enjoyed it when i've been here and the thing is when you got great beer to go with it hey all five of those tasty treats go easily down. Even the acai bowl with some beer, why not? Anyway, you have a great time here in San Diego. We have all kinds of videos to help you out. The Don'ts of San Diego, five things you love and hate about California. They're all coming, don't worry. You'll find them on our website at waltersworld.com. Also, if you've subscribed to us on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, we always announce those things. Anyway, the trolley's coming, so I gotta go. So have a great time and eat well here in San Diego. I mean, you will, it's awesome. <laughs> Bye. Seriously, if you're for the carne asada fries, Alberto's is a place to be, man. It was awesome. So you gotta tell thanks to my buddy Spence. He totally hooked me up and Scott over there. If you wanna learn some other stuff about actual photography things, definitely check out Photographers and Cars. I got the link below. It's well worth it. And yes, go eat here. You'll be happy. Wouldn't you agree? Yes, definitely. it was so good. <laughs> it was so yeah. good. Thanks, guys. All right.